In order to get a client invested correctly, we need to understand what their risk tolerance is. And while this isn't the only part of the equation, it is a huge part. The old way of stereotyping investors based upon age and categorizing them with semantic terms like aggressive or moderately conservative just doesn't cut it anymore. The term moderately conservative might mean something different to you than it does to me. Not only are these semantics subjective, the stereotypes are often dead wrong. 52% of 20 to 29 year olds aren't aggressive and 53% of 70 to 79 year olds aren't conservative. That's why risk assessments and risk alize are built upon decades of behavioral economic work and Nobel Prize winning framework called prospect theory. It all starts with our definition of risk tolerance. How far can a portfolio fall within a fixed period of time before the investor will capitulate and make a fear-bound decision? This risk assessment is built to quantify a client's risk tolerance in less than five minutes. And the beauty of it lies within its adaptive dynamic format. Using real dollar amounts, each question builds off the last to make a truly interactive experience. And did I mention you can embed this questionnaire on social media, in an email, or on your website? Whether your clients across the room or across the world, you can send them a link and walk them through the entire process from start to finish. If you need to capture multiple risk numbers for spouses and investment committee, it's easy to do that and reconcile them all into one risk number. And as great as questionnaires are, there will be times when a questionnaire just isn't the right experience. For these clients, you can manually set a risk target that matches their needs with just a few tasks. So gone are the days of stereotyping investors and picking a portfolio to match. When clients know their risk number, they know you're acting in their best interest.